Hello, this is Minister G.L. Hardy, and I'm coming to you again. Uh, and we're talking about the Nehemiah Project. Wonderful project that was birthed back in 2010. And it was in, it came to me at the time where I was in, uh, in a storm. I had lost a, a three-year relationship, engagement. I had lost a job. I had lost a home. I had lost many friends. And I was bouncing me, myself and my youngest daughter between my brother's home and my sister's home. And what a time that was. A time of confusion, a time of anger, uh, a fear, not knowing what, what tomorrow may bring. Didn't have a job. And waiting on a, an unemployment check that sometimes came and sometimes it didn't. It, 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 it was one of the worst times, uh, but one of the most wonderful times of my life. Because there, in that moment, I was able to hear a word from God because he had shut down everything in my life that had me distracted. And so awesome that was. And there I was, just me and God, pondering how was I going to get from point A to point B and uplift myself. And each and every waking day, my faith grew stronger and stronger. And by 2011, I was, by the end of 2010, I was working again. By the end of 2011, I formed the Holy Spirit's Internet Television Show. And then by 2013, I formed the uh, Holy Spirit's Blog Talk Radio Show. And then we began to buy His Blood Ministries as well. And this year, in 2013, we launched the Nehemiah Project, dealing with our young people who are tomorrow's leaders. And what this, and what this, what this Nehemiah Project entails is young people go, going out and being active in the communities and restoring communities back to where they once was by planting liberty gardens, taking their neighbors to, to the grocery or to, to a doctor's appointment, refurbishing abandoned buildings, Mowing lawns, taking the, your neighbor's dog for a walk. But what they're doing, what we're doing, we're, we're, we're instilling an empowerment in our youth by self-worth and through love, and through servitude, and through peace and humanity. That's how God had us to be in the beginning. We're going to be having nature nature trips, counseling sessions on their environment, how they how they have grown up in the environment. Many trips to other areas, other neighborhoods, evangelizing, witnessing of how good God is and how He's done great things in their lives. Wonderful project. It's going to take uh, effort. It's going to take time, but, but all, it's also going to take resources. So we're asking for a generous donation or even a sponsorship uh, if you would love to be a part of this project. We, we will be posting uh, uh, in a within a week or so videos and some photos of some of the things that we've been actively doing uh, in this season. And at the end of this video, if you'd like to donate to this wonderful cause of really helping these young people, I mean, it, 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 we're going to help them with, with, with books and school supplies. But this, this is a summer long project. The Nehemiah Project is a summer long project, but it also is year round because it's going to be empowering kids and helping kids, getting them all the help and the resources that they need to begin to be those leaders that God has already placed inside of them. So again, at the bottom of this link, uh, you can go to, go to the Gifts from the Heart page and give a, don a, a generous donation. And if you would like to be a sponsor, we would love to hear from you. And they will, there at the bottom of the screen as well will be our contact, page, our contact page. It is our hope that people begin to share this page and this site dealing with our youth to be able to begin to galvanize them, to uplift them, to inspire them into becoming 
the kings and queens that God intended them to be. Thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you real soon. Peace and God bless.